Welcome everyone to another mini session of the D7 Pathways Virtual Academy. Tonight, if you'll hang with me for just a few minutes, I will show you the two-step process for recording Pathways level completions and making sure that the member receives their educational award through Club Central. This has been an issue that has caused some confusion over the last several months since we've rolled out. So I will show you now exactly what those steps are with permission to use a vice president of education login because I am not a current vice president in my club. I am with permission using somebody else's login. They are sitting nearby making sure that I don't do anything nasty with their, with their password. Once you come to Toastmasters, you want to log in the regular way through Pathways. Now, this is assuming that you have received an email that says a member of your club has completed a level and please click on that level completion so that they can continue on with their project. Once you go into Pathways, log in regularly as you would into Pathways. And as a Basecamp manager, you have the additional option of logging in as a Basecamp manager. Be sure it is on the club that you are the Vice President of Education for and the one that you're recording the award in. Then click Login as Basecamp Manager. Under Basecamp Manager, all pending requests show up under this friendly blue button that says Pending Requests. How convenient is that? Absolutely. Click on the Pending Requests. This shows you a list of everyone that is that has completed a level or another project and is hoping for you to sign off on completion. As it turns out, we have a member here that it was completed a level one, the completion, the date, the time, et cetera. As the base camp manager, you would click on this little green check mark to approve the request and then process it through that way. I am not going to click on that because I am not a vice president of education and I am not going to approve this award right now, but this is exactly what you would do and follow those steps. Once you have completed those steps, you want to return to Toastmasters home page. Now that you can get to the visit pathway start page right here and go into leadership central. This is the second part of recording the award. When you're inside of pathways, you mark off the level completion so that the member can continue on to the next level and be able to work on those projects. But then you have to be sure to come into Leadership Central, click on Club Central, make sure you are doing business for the club that is the club that, in the, that the member is receiving the award for, not a different club that you are a officer in. And once you are in here, be sure to click on Submit Educational Awards. Now, if you're familiar with the legacy system, as in the competent communicator and competent leader, this is the same place that you need to come and record those awards. Pathways is the same in that aspect. You need to click on Submit Education Awards, then go through the process of choosing the arrow, finding the person responsible, and then providing them with their award through Club Central under the Leadership Central tab. If you do both of those steps. Not only will the member continue on in their level completion progress, but they will also receive the educational award that benefits the club. Now, it's vitally important. Remember, there are two steps for every Pathways level completion awards. <laughs> and thank you very much for hanging in with me, and I hope you have a wonderful night.